But we begin at five with that breaking news in Providence. Another ripped a bus crash is under investigation right now. This happened a couple of hours ago, not far from the state house. Let's get right to Eyewitness News reporter Kim Kalunian live in Providence with the breaking details. Ripta is investigating as we speak following a crash that occurred right here behind us not long ago. And in fact, the scene was cleared just over an hour ago. A Ripta bus was left with a gaping hole following a crash Tuesday afternoon. Eyewitness news cameras were rolling as the bus was towed away following the crash at this busy intersection. Stephen Terrell tells us he had just gotten on the bus at the Providence Place Mall when the accident happened. Shortly after getting on, it uh, veered off into the right. It took out one of the lights. The momentum then caused it to um, kind of kick over to the left. The crash happened just before 2.30 Tuesday afternoon at the intersection of Francis and Gatsby Streets. Terrell says it all happened quickly. Just a, a really uh, sudden, quick jolt. He says about six passengers and the female driver were all taken to area hospitals with what appeared to be minor injuries. Yeah, I just hope everyone's okay tonight. One side of the road was briefly closed while the scene was cleared. Police put caution tape around a light pole that lay fractured on the ground, surrounded by bits of broken glass. The bus was left with a windshield shattered by the impact. Now that fractured light pole is all that remains of this accident scene. Ripta says they will continue investigating. They're going to take a look at the police report to try and determine exactly what led up to this crash. Now coming up new at 6, we'll tell you what type of injuries witnesses say they saw passengers on board that bus suffer. Kim Kalunian, Eyewitness News. Now, developing news we first brought to you on Eyewitness News Live at 5. A ripped a bus crash in front of the Providence Place Mall. Four passengers and the driver were brought to the hospital. New at 6, details on the injuries they suffered. From the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Eyewitness News reporter Kim Kalunian is live in the capital city. The scene is clear now, but the crash actually happened right here behind us earlier today. Now, Ripta and police are investigating to try and determine exactly what happened. Eyewitness news cameras were rolling as a Ripta bus was towed away following a crash at this busy intersection Tuesday afternoon. The bus was left with a gaping hole on its side. Stephen Terrell tells us he had just gotten on the bus at the Providence Place Mall when the accident happened. Shortly after getting on, it uh, veered off into the right. It took out one of the lights. The momentum then caused it to um, kind of kick over to the left. The crash happened shortly before 2.30 Tuesday afternoon at the intersection of Francis and Gatsby Streets. Terrell says it all happened very quickly. Just a, a really uh, sudden, quick jolt. Ripta says four passengers and the female driver were taken to area hospitals with what appeared to be minor injuries. Uh, no one was unconscious. Just um, people were saying that, you know, um, there were a lot of neck braces going on. Uh, people were um, being taken off in stretchers. Ripta says they'll review the police report to determine exactly what caused the crash. And Ripta tells us tonight that that driver of that bus has been with them for more than 11 years and has a good driving record. They say speed does not appear to be a factor in this crash, but they will continue their investigation. Reporting live in Providence with the Mobile Newsroom, Kim Kalunian, Eyewitness News.